Hey, how's it going? The show is over. We sold a few things of coffee and made a few friends and so on. And I'm sitting here in my room looking at this sprinkler head for the fire system. And there's a sign on it that says, don't hang your clothes. <laughs> there's a, there's the, the circle with the line through it with a coat hanger. Don't hang your clothes on there. And I'm thinking to myself, is there that many people in the world that you have to put, that don't understand not to hang clothes on a sprinkler system? It's a fire thing, you know? There's that many people that need that sign. It reminds me of, I think it's Missouri, everybody in Missouri can hate me, but they have a, it's, it's just whatever state it is, they have signs all over the highway that say, you know, if it's raining, turn your headlights on. And I remember thinking the same thing. Don't they teach that in driver's ed? You know, reduced visibility, turn your headlights on. It reminds me of way back when I was in my 20s and my, my buddy pulling out. It's a four lane road, two lanes one way, two lanes the other way, and then the turn lane in the middle and we're pulling out of the old trailer park and he didn't turn his signal on. I said, dude, are you gonna turn your signal on? And he says to me, why? There's nobody behind me. And I'm thinking, screw the people behind you. What about the ones doing 50 miles an hour on the road you're about to pull out in front of? Don't you think they'd like to know where you're going so they can react to what you're gonna do? I just, it's mind boggling to me. But you know, that's human beings, that's human nature, it's the way you are. You have a body of knowledge, and whatever it is you know, you assume that everybody else knows, or that they think the same way. Now, I don't know how old you are watching this, but it doesn't matter. You have your view of the world, and there's a limited number of people that share it. You're just gonna have to take my word on this. If you haven't experienced it yet, you will. When it comes to marketing online, there are a given number of opinions out there. And some of them are false. Some of them you can prove are false real easy. And yet they persist year after year. It's like an urban myth. You've heard the one about the guy who's out of town and he meets this nice looking woman in a bar and she offers to buy him a drink and you know, he, he's talking to her and sips his drink and it's the last thing he remembers until he wakes up in a bathtub full of ice and there's a cell phone next to it says call 911 immediately and he calls and the operator seems to know what he's talking about and says, well, reach around your back. Do you feel a tube coming out? And he goes, yeah. And oh, well, they've harvested your kidneys. There's a gang of kidney thieves. It doesn't matter how long this thing's been out there. It's a load of crap, but it won't die. And that's the way these internet marketing myths go. Uh, one of the best ones is such and such is dead. Email is dead. No, Facebook is dead. No, <laughs> pick something else. It's dead. Never true. It's just that someone uses that headline or whatever to bring someone in who is obviously having trouble with whatever it is they're saying is dead and of course their solution is hey you know what leave that alone you've already failed it. Hey, you know what doesn't work come try this thing and the same guy can roll people over and it's like waves going down a, a set of waterfalls because if someone doesn't stick with one thing long enough they're never going to learn what it takes to make that particular media or platform work. So, everybody in the world may not know what you know, and you may not necessarily know all of the things that are true. But one thing that you can bank on, and it's almost the only way you can bank on, is to pick one single thing, one platform, one media, one company, Focus on one single thing at a time. Do it until you get good enough to make it work before you move on to something else. Because trust me on this, 
There is no end to the different things you can try if you continue to blame an outside factor for your lack of success. Because everywhere you go, you are the common denominator. One thing, do it till you get good. That's how you'll make it. That's all I got for today. I'll talk to you tomorrow. I'm out.